Hello friends and welcome to the architecture enthusiast and to Zeitenwende. A German word literally meaning, a turning point in history. Which means that the world afterwards will no longer be the same as the world before. In the worst case scenario of climate change, the Earth's temperature has risen leading to a 28 meter ocean level rise. This catastrophic event has led to widespread devastation across the United States, with the region surrounding New York City being one of the most affected. The once thriving city is now submerged under several meters of water, leaving millions displaced and causing unimaginable damage to the infrastructure, buildings, and lives. As the waters continue to rise, surrounding communities have been submerged in 20 feet of water leaving many residents displaced and struggling to rebuild their lives. In response, the federal government has invested in a bold plan to build resilient communities in an attempt to repopulate the East Coast. The plan begins by accepting the new environmental realities as permanent wetlands. Beginning by constructing barges supporting raised ramps and walkways and connecting elevated apartments to form a network of buildings. Hydroponic and aeroponic farms are created on the roofs of these buildings, and within dedicated structures, to provide fresh produce for the community. New facilities are built to collect insects, now flourishing in this environment, and harvesting and process them as food to provide a protein source. Decades earlier small modular nuclear reactors were made practical with a safe, permanent disposal solution. Deep borehole disposal ushered in a fresh approach to nuclear waste management. With the help of micro-nuclear power plants, raised monorail, barges and flying drone support vehicles, submerged towns have been transformed into a water environment with elevated buildings and infrastructure. These towns have become a model for sustainable living, with large indoor farming and power generation. The use of new technologies such as insect harvesting and urban farming, combined with traditional farming techniques, have provided a sustainable and reliable food source for the town. This approach has led to new economic opportunities, creating jobs for those with agricultural and technological expertise. These new communities have also turned to innovative methods for food production. Community-wide raised walkways and supporting infrastructure on barges has been built, allowing people to navigate through the water-filled environment. Although these communities face challenges, they also saw opportunities. The large indoor farming operations provided a boost to the local economy, with excess produce being sold to nearby emerging communities. However, living in a world where the end of the world as we knew it has occurred, has taken a toll on the mental health of residents. The community has come together to provide education and support, creating a safe haven for those in need. The absence of ground vehicles has led to cleaner air, reducing respiratory illnesses. Peace of mind in knowing that public safety is enhanced with flying drone vehicle that support fire, police and ambulance services. The communities also use drone buses and trucks to transport people between adjacent wetland communities and goods from out-of-state suppliers. As new communities are restored, a new link with New York City has been established through the raised monorail system and ferries. The economic link has brought new opportunities for growth and development, cementing their place as a model for sustainable living. In addition to the innovative housing solutions, the town has taken steps to address environmental concerns. Floating barges, planted with swamp-like vegetation. Connect buildings via raised ramps and walkways. They serve a dual purpose of providing protection against rising waters and of allowing water and natural habitats to flow beneath, acting as ecological filters to help clean the water and provide a sustainable ecosystem. To ensure the sustainability of communities, they have each installed raised micro sewer treatment plants and freshwater treatment facilities to provide access to clean water and to treat waste. Recycling and waste management have taken on a new urgency to maintain the health and resiliency of the communities. To ensure resiliency, the towns are separated from other communities by five miles of water, promoting a sustainable environment. One of the most significant challenges that these communities will face is removing and salvaging the submerged buildings, bridges, 
roads and infrastructure and cleaning up the fuels and toxins that have contaminated the area. The salvaged materials from the submerged remnant are used to create new buildings and infrastructure and reinforce resiliency. Despite the positive changes, the effects of ocean current changes have caused severe storms and storm surges, leading to further damage and displacement. The federal government has provided aid, but the community continues to face challenges as they adapt to a new way of life. In this new world, people have shown resilience, ingenuity, and perseverance in the face of unimaginable adversity. They serve as a reminder that even in the darkest of times, hope and progress are possible. After the initial shock and despair, communities came together to try to find a way to survive and thrive in this new reality. With their homes and infrastructure destroyed, they were forced to think creatively and adapt to their new environment. However, these communities were not immune to the effects of the changing climate. Storms and storm surges were frequent, and the community had to be constantly prepared for potential flooding. The changing ocean currents also had an impact on the local ecosystem, requiring new adaptation strategies to be developed. Despite these challenges, people were determined to make the best of their situation. They had created unique and sustainable communities and adapted to the challenges of climate change. The lessons learned serve as a blueprint for other communities facing similar challenges in the future.